all roads are leading to Atlanta for Bill Belichick. Oh. He is in his second round of interviews down there, meeting the executive level of the Atlanta Falcons, where the first time it was just him and Arthur Blank on a yacht, seemingly, yep. is what we've kind of gathered from the internet and other Did sources. Bill Chopper out to it or what? How'd that go? I think he actually canoed. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Oh, he, he's, he's gritty. He, that's why. World class swimmer, too. Yeah. He, he might have just butterflied his whole way. He probably down. took his yacht. Oh, yeah. He might have. Of course. Yeah. What yeah. are we yeah. talking yeah. about? He took eight rings. What's that? I'm, I'm pretty sure that this first round of interviews, because they have a date, they have a new deal based on the rules from New York, that everything is Zoom, the first round of interviews. That's why you get so many guys interviewed from, from the jump. So I, I don't know if this I, is probably I saw the, the third thing. one you're saying. Tampering? Oh, you're saying he didn't go on the yacht. This is just the internet. No, that's what I'm saying. I think that's just the internet Got speculating it. and saying that. Because I it. think Monday, this Monday, is actually the date mm -hmm. where you can start having in person interviews okay so anyways arthur blank and bill talked for three and a half hours yes was it on a yacht we have no idea it, sure. the internet said nice it was on was. a yacht but it might be you know now they're at the time where he is making this take place yeah bill belichick mm -hmm. to the atlanta falcons seemingly in everybody's eyes gonna happen aj your thoughts on billy b taking over down in atlanta well i mean i I'm all for it, Bill. If I was if I was running a, a, a franchise, I would definitely want to bring Bill in and have an interview. I'd want to just I would just want to see what he has to say. How do you want to run this, this franchise? What are you going to do? But also, yeah, I mean, I think it's going to be awesome. I think the people in Atlanta will absolutely embrace Bill if he does get the gig. But he's got to figure out the quarterback situation first. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have the eighth overall pick. Yep, I believe, and they have some pieces they could probably move. If they're able to have success down there, he needs 15 more wins to become the winningest coach in the history of the NFL, which I assume is the only reason why any of this is still taking place because he's so damn close. As a Patriots fan, how do you feel about it? I feel fine, actually. I think no matter where he went, I was going to root for him. I kind of wanted Dallas just because it would be a great partnership. I am more so worried that uh, David Tepper might blow up the city uh, in Carolina just because of the fact that he's going to realize, okay, now I don't have a head coach. No one wants to be here. The greatest coach of all time and GM of all time is in my division. I bought a team that isn't going to win for the next 25 years. I, I don't know what to do, but I'm happy for Bill.